Inverness had only been defeated twice at the Tullough Caledonian Stadium in the past calendar year. It's Nick Ross. Now to Raven. Goes to Ross. Into the chest of Watkins, but he was barged in the back by Paul McGinn. Inverness will have the free kick. Tanzi, the specialist over this one. It's Greg Tanzi. Scott Bain grabs it at the second attempt. Just bouncing in a horrible position just in front of the goalkeeper. Deep. Two points behind Hamilton Ackes. They do have two games in hand. And they are hopeful of getting into the top six. It's Tanzi again and flicked on. Wide of the target. Bain clears. It's all more when these two first met way back in August. Raven. Let's look to get forward and into the box for Watkins. Might drop for Doran, taken away by McGinn. Tansy desperately looking for a shooting opportunity. Well, Scott Bain got into the right position to make the save. Tansy was always looking to shoot. Shinny oh, bursting forward, links up with Doran. Shinny again into Doran. Doran to let fly. Well, plenty of power behind the shot. And that called Scott Bain into action. Good save by the Dundee goalkeeper. Inverness, too, finding themselves a little isolated in the table. Eight points behind Aberdeen, seven above Dundee United. Tansy. Doran to try another one. And again, Scott Bain makes a save. You need to be nearer a corner to beat a goalkeeper of his standard. Reaper got in there, but Warren with a poor touch. Now this is Stewart. McGowan now breaks away of Clarkson! And Dundee have the opening goal. Clarkson, eight minutes into the second half, and at long last, the drought for the striker is over. Oh, what a valuable lead this could be for Dundee. Willie Collum. Is just taking action here. It will be Paul McGowan who will go into the book. He took the celebrations off the field of play. There's Clarkson. He hasn't lost that finishing touch. Back amongst the goals. And this will now be a real test of Inverness Caledonian Thistle's resolve. They haven't won in their last four league games. Tansy pings it forward. Watkins straight into the attack or Inverness. Ross now finds its way all the way to Shinny at the back post. And they're level. Instant response from Inverness. Barely a touch on the ball by a Dundee player since the goal. Shinny has equalised. It's Conrad's header. But not troubling Ryan Essen. Meekings beats McGowan, striding forward purposely. Doran, still Aaron Doran. And he should have done better with that. Ian Davidson misjudging the flight of the ball. Shinny now. Inverness continue this fantastic home record. Doran once more, having to turn back to his captain, Graham Shinney, the goal scorer. It's Draper, high and over the top from the midfielder. Watkins, that's a good header, Oferi, inches wide. And it will end up all square as it did back in August. 